<laughs> Lucinda, if you care about me or your sister, you will not leave this house. That boy has been nothing but trouble since you met. Of course you'd say that. He said you would. He told me you would never understand our love. You're too busy trying to please Richard that you don't even care about us anymore. You know that's not true. There's nothing I care more about than you and your sister. You're my children. I love you. You've never loved anyone except the first man with a six-figure salary who paid you any attention. I promise I'll come back for you. Alright, you'll not corrupt her like he corrupted you. You want to be an adult? Go. We won't be here when you get back. Try not to screw her up while I'm gone. You're stronger than her. Don't forget that. She hated that dress, and the flowers, and the wedding. Mostly the dress. It wasn't black enough. I never thought any of this could happen. And I never meant for you to be any part of it. I know, um... She was right. About everything. Especially about you being stronger than me. Not stronger, just more practical. You wanted too much, you didn't want enough. I was bound to be the perfect balance. I... I just wish I could take it back. You can't. It needed to happen. Okay. Well, it happened. What now? We clean things up, put on a band-aid or two, and heal. It'll take time, but I watched you chase a man for seven years. If you can get Richard to marry you, you can do just about anything. How did I raise such an amazing kid? You didn't. You can thank Grandma for that. Promise me one thing. You won't leave me like your sister. I promise. I guess promises were meant to be broken.